One person I did know was Dennis Hopper because I'd met Dennis in New York in Andy Warhol's studio in 1963. I happened to be there with a friend. We'd gone, he said, come to the studio then. I mean, Andy wasn't that well known, but uh, Dennis turned up with his wife and Henry Geltzal, who I'd never met then. We met in, in Andy's studio and Dennis, I remembered, I said to Andy at the time, I said, you know, I've seen his face somewhere. He said, where, where? And I, I said, hey, it's a film. I think it was on 42nd Street. And when Dennis left, Henry, Andy and I went down and we found it. And the film was called Night Tide, made by Curtis Harrington. And Dennis played a sailor. And it was all filmed on uh, Venice Pier. And so then through Dennis, you meet people, you know. There were gay bars here, you see, that even New York didn't have. There was a big one on uh, on uh, Melrose Avenue that just, I thought, was this is fantastic. I mean, nothing like that in London at the time. Nothing like it, I don't think anywhere else, actually. It was California. And occasionally, the police raided it. But I don't know why, I mean, it, it, and they had a big outside of the back and fires and you'd, you know, I mean to me it was full of like dreamy uh, surfers, blonde surfers, I mean uh, if you're gay you like that, you know, you think well this is I think all gay people like California a little bit, I do, because of because it's sunny people wear less clothes, you know, t-shirts uh, they tend to look after their bodies uh, you can overdo it with the body, but um, uh, that was an attraction. I thought it was sexy. It was, compared to England then. I mean, London, 1963 or 64, was, you know, not had many fresh pain. He was pretty grim. Uh, those odd little gay pubs in Earl's Court were not much. There were still loads of old ladies in the corner not knowing about the Leather Queen over there. But, you know, I mean, it wasn't, uh, wasn't too much. Mm -hmm.